much quieter than yesterday. But nationally, the same storm system is still uh, causing quite the issue. You can see storms out ahead of that cold front stretching up into Missouri through Arkansas into Louisiana, and those will continue to push into the Mid South as we move on into this morning. Back to the west, though, notice for us it is clearing up, and behind this front, we will not only clear up, but we're also going to be talking about temperatures that are tumbling a little bit more as we go on through this morning. So many of you, especially if you're off to the east, you're waking up to 60s. But notice what happens as we travel on into the next couple of hours. We will drop off several more degrees, 40s back to the northwest around the metroplex, probably more so low 50s, and then we will rebound as we head into this afternoon. But yes, a cooler air and a drier air on the way. It's even colder tonight, clear sky, and really the heart of that cooler air mass will be here by then with temperatures in the upper 30s as we wake up on Friday. Conditions right now, it is still breezy out there, certainly. Winds out of the northwest up to 20, 22 miles per hour around Dallas and around DFW. Temperatures in the 50s to the low 60s, so still kind of mild there in Dallas, 63, but that cooler air is moving into Tarrant County as Fort Worth right now wakes up to 54 degrees. Winds out of the northwest still going to stay on the breezy side, just not nearly what we saw yesterday. We don't have a wind advisory or anything like that, but uh, through the day we will see winds up to 25 miles per hour possible, especially through this morning period. And then as we roll on into the afternoon, those winds will start to relax and temperatures get into the mid 60s. So a really nice looking day and a nice forecast. Happy to say will stay with us as we head on into the start of this weekend. As we look ahead into Friday, we start off in the upper 30s, but as we get into the afternoon, we'll have some sunshine. Temperatures tomorrow will be even lower. Highs getting into the upper 50s. We'll stay there to start the weekend to Saturday, 59, and Sunday for St. Patrick's Day, 62 degrees.